About a month ago, I was here in Las Vegas and I test drove a red Roadster. It was one of the last 20 ever made. It's one of only 70 that has every single option that you can get on a Tesla. And it's red like the one that went to space. And I couldn't get this thing out of my mind over the last month. And so, what's better than one Roadster? Two Roadsters. We're gonna buy this Roadster. This is it. This is the red Tesla Roadster that is in incredible shape and such a beautiful car. Why are you selling it? Isn't this your baby? It's my Betty, Betty Boop. Betty Boop, and yeah. you bought it originally when? The end of 2011. What made you decide to buy a Tesla Roadster? Because a lot of people weren't buying them back then. I just had a friend that his dad worked for uh, another electric demo place. He says, hey, you can go online and design your own car. So I just thought that was cool. So I designed my own car. The amazing thing is that Tesla owners, especially original Tesla owners, are so incredibly nice that she has given me her Tesla jacket and a couple of things. This is a cover for the Roadster. The original charger right here, which is a really good charger. And then also just the actual wall charger that you would use on a regular car. And then check out the trunk. Super clean. This car is incredibly clean and new with the back trunk because they replaced the battery pack. How long ago did they replace the battery pack? Three or four months, that's it, okay. Three or four months, new battery pack. Tire inflation kit, not one, but uh, two of them, which is good. Did you pick out the color on this, like the red? I picked the color out and the design, and you know, this is a duplicate of the one he sent to space. He copied me <laughs> on my design. That's how I ended up with a lot of free stuff. In all of their marketing videos, you see one just like this. So I'm gonna throw up some marketing videos that Tesla has used, not just when they had the Roadster and they are trying to sell it, but also when they launched the new Roadster. Up on screen, they had a red one that looked just like this with the same red, which this red has a bit of... Yours is the one in the ad? Yep, they used it for an ad, um, Tesla ad, before I got it. So I had to wait two months longer. I had to wait two months longer. This is the exact one inside of the Tesla ads. I wondered why when I watched the ads, it looks so much like this, like the color is so unique. They told me it's the one in the ads. The VIN number is 1443, so it's the 1443rd one made. I think they made like 1460, 1453, something like that. So it was one of, one of the last 20 ever made. I'm gonna buy this car and, uh, and, and take the car and hopefully be able to drive it home today to Southern Utah, but I'm just really excited. Thank you so much for the car. Welcome. I'll take good care of it. Yes, All right, guys, here is the car. I pulled it out. It's in the sunshine. You can kind of see the reflections on it. It's in really good shape. Um, super beautiful. Let's go on, hit the road. Before I finish going home, I wanna make sure I have enough juice to get there, because you may not. This battery doesn't have as many miles as well like a, a regular Tesla Model S or Model X might have. It has the 3.0 battery pack, so it should be, they say like 400 miles, but I don't buy that. It probably, it's probably gonna be like 250 or something. So how do you charge it? This is something by a company called HC Sharp, The Art of Charging. It's a thing I bought for a few hundred dollars from some guy back east that hand makes these things. Because if you come to a Tesla service center or Tesla place, you can't use a supercharger. It doesn't talk to the battery pack. And so you see these destination chargers that they have here at Tesla. You can use these, but this end is different. It doesn't work with the Tesla. So what you have to do is you have to take this thing and plug it into here. And now you can take this and plug it into your Roadster. How are you doing today? Good, how are you guys? Yeah. Better now that I saw your phone. Gotta get this thing charged up. All right, so the light is blue right now. Usually it says how much longer it has to charge, but it's not saying that. Good news, we've made it home. I don't know how excited the family's gonna be because they already have the blue one and they were so excited about that one, but I'm glad that it had enough miles to get back. I still have like 50 miles range, which is pretty accurate to where it said originally, so I'm happy about that. Oh, it looks so cool. What the? 
The seats are like leather, everything. What, it's carbon fiber? Carbon fiber, baby. What is this, what is this? I know, carbon fiber oh inside. Oh my gosh, those seats look actually really nice and cozy. It's still small, just like <laughs> the other one. <laughs> it's just as small. It's nice. It fits you, buddy. Yeah. Maybe this needs to be your high school car. Yes. Yes, I would love that. That'd Look at the thing, awesome. Roadster Sport. It's a sport edition, so it's the best one they've, they've made. The Where'd you say that? Right here? Oh, nice. So which one do you like better, the blue one or the red one? I like the colors of the blue one, but the, I like this one. So just as hard to get out to. When Elon uh, came out with the new Roadster, look at this one. Watch, the look at the red one. That, that yeah. Baby got us going. A new Roadster. Do you see the one up top? We are yeah. making it now. Yeah. yeah. Nice truck over there. Turns out, this is the exact car. No, it's that, not. This is what Tesla used for their commercial. No, it's not. This is a legit one. No, she said it's that not. she didn't get it for an extra two months because they asked if they could film stuff with it. And so they took it out, and this is the one in the video when Elon Musk was saying, this was the past, this is what shaped the way. This is the exact car. What? Did you know that? I didn't know it until we were there talking about it. What? Yeah. That's the, amazing! The only difference was the inside was black and they switched it out because she really didn't like the black. She wanted the tan in there. We have the Tesla from the Tesla commercials. The original one too and Sport Edition. So cool. Come on. Sorry, we gotta get your opinion on this car. Wait, what? Wait, is this the one? Did you really buy this? Woohoo! Yes, I bought this. <laughs> we have a red one and a blue one now. Where are we gonna keep it? They're in our new house. Mom say yes? She said whatever makes me happy. Oh my gosh, now we have two! Does it go faster? It's a little bit faster, it has a rear backup camera, it's a little more comfortable, it has a way better range, it has a brand new battery pack in it. The, the speakers. Are they speakers are good, they're good. I like the blue better. Why? <laughs> because it's blue. Doesn't yeah. the red look good though? Yeah, and then the seats are different too. Yeah. I like it. Cool. cool. There you go, new car. <laughs> Yay. Where are we going to keep it outside? I, don't know. I think we're going to put it in here somehow. I don't know how. Here they are side by side. Here is the red one. Here is the blue one. I still love the blue. It's super dirty right now. But I've noticed some differences. First, look at the front. It's pretty round. It's uh, pretty basic right here. And it's round again. But then look at this one. Carbon fiber on the bottom. You've got this super sporty little move in it. And then the front looks a little different. And the same thing on the other side. Definitely plus one for the Roadster 3.0 versus this one when it comes to that look. The back side, again, mine is so dirty right now. If you look down here, it just has this little tiny black thing at the bottom, not very sporty. And then you look over here, this big heavy plastic thing with the rear backup camera, and that looks a lot sporty on the bottom. A lot sportier on the bottom. It used to say Roadster right here, I guess, but they took it off and they put R80 when they got the battery upgraded. So this one doesn't have any writing right there. And again, like I said, super dirty. I know, take care of your cars. I will, I'll take care of it when we get our new house. <laughs> so there we are, blue versus red. They are both pretty beautiful. I love them both. I love all my children. Okay, now to make room for it in my garage, which we are gonna be moving here pretty soon. It's been a year and a half, and this is a bunch of stuff. It took a year longer than we thought. This is from the Honda Accord. My electric car doesn't do this, but look how nasty that is. So we have like a one and a half size garage, but it's full of stuff. I think I'm gonna get this junk, move it somehow over here, throw away some stuff, and then uh, park the roadsters in here. All right, um, not ideal, but we only have like three weeks, and then we can do this. Three Teslas in one garage. Luckily, these two are smaller. Now we need to get these bad boys charged. Successful charging, we've got these bikes right here. I put this cover over the side of it so these bikes don't hit into it. But you can't go all the way because you can't cover up those fans. As you can hear, they get going sometimes. So I'm just putting it on this side so no accidental scratches happen. And the jacket fits it Lincoln. She gave us this free jacket. Tesla, it's all red. Look at the back of it. Oh Tesla. my. And even the best part is, Tesla shirt. I didn't even realize that you were bringing this here today, but I wore my Tesla shirt today. And I wore mine too. This is 
And I got Tesla on Tesla, and then you got Tesla too. Tesla on Tesla on Tesla, and look at my shoes. Nike Tesla shoes. All right, we did it. We have two Roadsters now. Um, we're gonna be doing some more videos comparing the two and getting some really high quality shots with this. I really wanna paint protect it and do some things and clean this other one up also. And when we get the new house, I have a few ideas to really help these stand out and look good in the garage. Oh, and a side note, Zach Jerry rig everything. He has a red one. It's a little bit different color red than this. And his is one of the first 130 ever made. That's awesome. This is one of the last 20 ever made, so it's a totally different spectrum. So it'll be pretty cool. We're gonna get Zach to bring his Roadster down here and we can like race all three, go driving with all three. It's gonna be pretty cool. But um, for now, I own two Roadsters. I'm kind of crazy. Hey, one day it'll be three, so. And maybe four, if he, cause like we, we get half off of a second next gen Roadster. So we might have four. Maybe we have to get a red and a blue next gen Roadster and then we have four. That's a lot of Roadsters.